Good morning, Rena Weber, City Administrator from Rockville. I asked the question of what does the fourth Fourth of July mean to me, or what do I remember most about the Fourth of July? Well, I can remember growing up as a kid. My mom and dad had a cabin out at Big Fish Lake, and my dad worked for the Granite Company, and so every Every Fourth of July week, the Granite Company always shut down for vacation. And um, I came from a rather large family of eight kids, plus mom and dad. And so Fourth uh, of July was our big vacation out at the lake. We never went camping or anything like that. Um, anyway, uh, my mom used to bake tons of cookies. And uh, I mean tons, just three, four you know, big kettles full, and she'd hide them underneath her bed. And if she really thought that nobody was knew that they were there, boy, was she wrong. Because come the Fourth of July week, uh, pretty much most of those were gone. She'd have to rebake. But uh, it was always fun just to go out to the lake, and we'd have an open fire where we'd uh, make hot dogs and you know make s'mores, the typical stuff. But uh, <laughs> those cookies, that was something else. Anyway, that's my memory. You know. My favorite Fourth of July uh, memories, probably uh, when I was in college. I went to college at Northwestern College in uh, Roseville, Minnesota. They have a very large uh, bell tower that's that's taller than all the other uh, buildings in the area. And we, uh, you know, I was I was a maintenance custodian guy, so I had all the keys to the entire campus. And so myself, uh, as a maintenance guy, and most of the campus security folks that got stuck working on the, the fourth would uh, would actually take watermelon and coolers and you know sodas and and a little mini grill and, and literally go up into the bell tower and have our own little private uh, Fourth of July party up there and have some brats and and just sit and and the neat thing was is because we were sort of up on a hill anyhow and now in a bell tower you could see somewhere between 30 and 40 different fireworks displays uh, at any given time so every community in the north metro area of the twin cities that had a fireworks display you would see now granted they were all about this big but you could see four or five, six of them at a time and see how they were staggered and stuff like that. Really kind of a neat uh, memory and a uh, time of camaraderie with, with folks to just kick back and spend some time with friends. Probably my, my favorite memory of the 4th of July. a unique 4th of July story? Email us at Digilog Ricori and your story could appear on the website.